So today I'm gonna to give you a way to get rid of that texture pattern from your scanned images on oil painting canvas or something like that. And so with my oil painting scanned in, you'll notice I did it in several pieces and you can see the ways the texture goes from the scan. So you can see it's vertical here because I rotated it in several pieces and then brought it in and pieced it together. And so in order to get rid of this, I'm going to do a couple different things. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna copy the layer and I'm gonna go into filter, blur, Gaussian blur. And I'm going to blur it so that the texture pattern is basically going away. Um, I want it to almost be a complete blur. So this is an actual really large piece. So I'm gonna just say, okay and that's going to blur that. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait for this blur to get done here, and then I'm going to copy this picture again. And just to make sure we name things properly, I'm gonna say this is my blurred, and then I'm gonna copy this, and this copy I'm gonna put above it. I'm gonna go into image, apply image, and I'm going to do a copy uh, so I'm going to do my blurred copy here and that's you're going to notice that it's going to pop that texture in there I'm going to do blending mode subtract. I'm going to do scale of 2 and offset of 128 I'm going to say okay, and that's going to do its thing and you're going to be left with Almost all the texture from your image now if you zoom up into it you can actually see where that uh, it's separating the painting as well as separating everything else. So I'm going to copy this image here and I'm going to undo this and I'm going to go and say invert, which is just control I. And what that's going to do is going to flip my normals from there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to hide this and I'm going to go into and do a linear light. And so with that linear light, you'll notice that immediately my texture pattern went away quite a bit. And so what I'm gonna do from there is I'm going to, you can zoom up and you can see it's not quite as crisp as I want. So I'm gonna do a select all, which is a control A. I'm going to do a copy merged. So edit, copy merged. Control shift C and I'm going to just paste a new layer and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to filter and I'm going to go into sharpen and smart sharpen and the smart sharpen will bring up a panel that allows me to basically go through and kind of clean up what I want. I'm going to raise the amount, so you want to raise it and lower it until you kind of find out where you like it. And this looks pretty good for me, and I'm just going to say OK and let that do its thing. Now it'll take a bit again to load up and do as well, but in the end result you will have your painting without all the textures in there. Thanks for watching, and if you like this piece of artwork, it's going to be for sale on my Etsy store. Like and subscribe, and thanks a lot.